fanboys, 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 how do I hate thee, how do I loathe thee, how do I just want you to be fucking exterminated from all of existence, how I would love to be able to just click a magic button and suddenly make you fucking think like a rational human being, be able to fucking absorb facts and understand opinions rather than make endless fucking mountains of excuses for something that you have a preference for, but you take it beyond just being a fan, beyond it just being a preference on something that you like or you fucking engage in whenever you're fucking bored. No, 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 no. You make this shit into a fucking religion as if it's a fucking goddamn cult. A lifestyle. And you will defend this shit to your dying breath like a no shit fucking dying breath. I am at the moment fucking relapsing. I am fucking dying. I am going to go and utter a couple last words defending the company I love so much and doesn't know I fucking exist. Fanboys, sicken me. If there was something in gaming that I could get rid of, would it be some of the terrible fucking features that go and pop up and crop up every so often in every single console generation from respective third party companies, from first party companies? No! I would go straight to fucking fanboys. This would somehow cleanse an entire fucking world of an illogical fucking stance. All of them are useless, brainless, spineless, fucking mobile sacks of flesh that make no fucking sense whatsoever. If you try to reason with them, the worst thing that's going to fucking happen is you're going to hear them fucking respond. And the response for a rational human being, for somebody with even a fucking iota of common sense, it's going to drive them off a fucking wall. It's going to make them fucking miserable because they're fucking boneheads. They're drones. It, it doesn't matter what facts you bring to them. It doesn't even matter if the fucking CEO and the COO and all the fucking people that work for the company and the higher up, the entire fucking hierarchy comes that and they tell them directly to their face. They fucking bring a goddamn graphs and fucking charts and they show them. They have fucking scientists explain it. It wouldn't matter if you fucking did it with a pop-up book so that their fucking simple minds be able to rationalize with this. No, they would still, well, you see, stupid fucking <laughs> constantly, consistently sucking on the teeth of their favorite fucking company. I can't stand it. You know what sucks the most is anytime, if you are an unbiased person, genuinely, if you are an unbiased person and you don't have a particular stance, you're willing to kind of just hover in that gray area and look at everything from both sides of the fence. If you say anything negative, any fucking thing negative about their preferred console or company or what the fuck ever platform of choice, they automatically will label you as a hater, and then he must be a fanboy of whatever the fucking competition is. If, say I was going and saying I had a problem with a fucking Mac, huh, you must be a Windows fanboy. What the fuck are you talking about? I was just saying that this didn't work right. Yeah, Windows fanboy, oh, you're so fucking gay. It's like, what the fuck? Are you kidding me? This is the, this is what the fuck you actually say? Mac all the way, and they're just sitting there fucking rubbing themselves all up and down with fucking iPhones and iPods and fucking iTouches. And well, the iTouch actually makes sense in this fucking goddamn situation. But then look at like this: Xbox One had a bunch of stupid ass fucking features. Obviously, a lot of people are pretty fucking pissed off about it. It's not like this asshole is fucking alone. So bring up all the facts, facts. Fucking facts! Hello! Facts! Like a carnival of fucking facts! A merry-go-round of fucking facts! Hop on a fucking fact ride! Woo! We can just fucking go everywhere! It doesn't matter how often they fucking see this shit, how often it's fucking drilled into their brain. They're just, you're a hater! You must be a Sony fanboy! Oh, oh, oh do you see PlayStation games there? I must be a Sony fanboy! Yeah, you're, you're fucking brainless! That's the only thing I can even fucking say. I actually wanted this fucking system to do well. And people are like, oh, you're, you're kind of a fanboy of a, a Sony. What the fuck are you talking about? What the fuck are you fucking talking about? You fucking ignoramus. What the fuck are you talking about? If Sony did the same exact shit, I would be saying the same exact shit. I don't give a fuck. 
If Nintendo fucks up, I, I just fucking say it. If Sony fucks up, I say it. If Microsoft fucks up, I say it. If there's anything that is fucked up, you should say something because if you give a fuck, then you take a goddamn stance and you tell them not to do it. You fucking put your foot down and you tell them, stop. Just fucking stop. But oh, oh no, 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 no. Fucking fanboys are all about fucking spooning with their favorite company. Even if that favorite company came in and fucking shot their entire family, dead in the fucking face, killed every goddamn one of them, they would still fucking cuddle up with them at night. Like, it's okay, I don't mind. Uh, maybe we can get some co-op in later. Uh, it's like... What fucking world am I living in? And I mean, look, I've been putting up with this shit ever since the fucking days of Nintendo versus Sega. My brother had a fucking Sega, I had a Nintendo. Best of both worlds. I didn't understand people taking a fucking suit. Yeah, but it's 16 bits. Who the fuck what? Who the fuck cares? I'm just playing games. Oh, well, better graphics. And? Like, it, they're just games. You're supposed to have fun. That's like saying, oh, this movie has better special effects. Automatically makes this movie a million times better than the one you're watching. <laughs> it's like, no, dude. No. You're fucking high as a goddamn fucking kite. Want to bring your shit down. Maybe fucking get that updraft fucking just completely cut off and bring your shit back down to fucking earth and get this fucking shit reorganized in your fucking noggin. But no, your fucking head meat, it doesn't fucking work that way, does it? No. No, and, and this is the thing. I've wanted to make a video about fanboys for ages, but I kind of include just those little random fucking blurbs and fucking mini rants about fanboys in every other video. I just, I get so fucking sick of it. And it's because there's a new console generation coming up. So you got PC fanboys saying, who the fuck cares about this shit? PC Master Race. Yeah, PlayStation fanboys and oh, oh, guess what? Our console is all fucked up and retarded like yours. Xbox fanboys are like, oh, we're actually going the way of the future. It's like Steam and we have all those fucking games that you don't. And you have people like me just saying, shut the fuck up. That's all I really demand. Just shut the fuck up. If you're if you're really all just gamers, then why don't you just fucking play games? Whoa, 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 wait a minute. Hold the fucking horses. Stop the presses. Just play games? Do you mean I can't just sit there and fucking try to drill into everybody's head that I have a preference and that theirs is automatically inferior because of my chosen preference? What the fuck kind of insanity is this? Is this the Twilight Zone that I'm living in? Some alternate fucking dimension? Did the fucking Flashpoint thing actually occur? Barry Allen, you fucking trickster. Oh man, look. And, and you want to know what's really sick? I'll just throw this out there. I've never seen a, seen a fucking handheld fucking like fanboy shit going down. It's like, look, it, Game Boy's always been like top shit, but I never saw somebody even like, oh, engage. Because I always felt bad for those motherfuckers. And you never saw anybody being a fanboy of the Gamecom, because it's like, <laughs> if anything, more love should have been towards like the fucking Neo Geo Pocket Killer, because that was fucking awesome. PSP deserves more love. Just, oh man, that, that's one of those things. It's always like consoles and PCs, and that's really fucking it. But then, poor handhelds, they get left out there. It's like, anybody want to argue about us? I had fucking t torches and pitchforks and shit. Guns? Knives. Uh, chains? Baseball bats, pipes, brass knuckles, anything. Well, sup? Broken fucking bottle. Come on, this is a fucking bar shank. Eh? God damn it. We count too. But it's like the most passive fucking ground to go and be on. But seriously, man, how many times have you just encountered the dumbest fucking shit just when having a casual conversation? I've had this shit occur in video game stores, I've had it occur on the fucking streets, I've had it occur at friends' houses, and I've had an endless fucking gory sea of stupidity occur on the internet. I swear to fucking Christ on a fucking cracker and a fucking stick that the internet is a fucking breeding ground for fanboy goddamn gluttony and stupidity of the highest caliber to the point of no fucking return. I wear a Star Wars shirt. You want to know what I'd rather do than put up with all that fucking shit, see it, and have to fucking digest that shit? I'd rather the fucking Death Star fly up my urethra and find my fucking weak point and blow me the fuck up. I, I fucking hate it. It just, it's just, it fucking blows my head up. This, why? Why? 
<laughs> oh, you Nintendo fanboy? Oh, those gay little kid games? Oh, Sony fanboy? Oh, fucking weak ass online? Oh, Xbox fanboy? Oh, how's the Xbox like Red Ring or Just shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! I swear to fucking God, if I could get an entire arena, I'd just put those motherfuckers right in the center, and I'd start the biggest, loudest, most endless fucking chant. Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! And just... Fucking play games. Now, again, if any of you ha have any kind of a, a little story that you want to share, please, by all means. You're, you're listening and looking at an individual that is just so fucking sick and tired of seeing the dumb fucking bullshit. Whether it's all legitimate and genuine and just full out fucking retarded or... <laughs> It might be the fucking feeble troll attempt to go and get a rise out of things just to fucking disrupt shit and cause waves or even ripples, if at all possible, out of plain fucking boredom. But it all just comes down to this. Just play fucking video games. Just fucking play video games. Seriously. Stop the fucking fanboy shit. I put up with it in music, within fucking mu movies, with fucking video games most especially. If I just want all to fucking stop and just shut the fuck up. I know that this video isn't the fucking be all end all and it never fucking will end because it's impossible. But goddamn, did I have to fucking vent about this shit? And if you don't fucking like what I'm saying, then fuck off! Don't ever come back! Hit back on the fucking browser! Thumb the video down if you don't fucking like me! Sh really fucking apart! I don't give a shit! Shit. That's the thing. I do not fucking give a shit if you don't fucking like me or what the fuck I'm saying. If you have a fucking preference and you want to ride its fucking dick right off into the fucking sunset, roll credits, then that's your fucking prerogative. But I sure as shit I'm going to have a fucking opinion about it whenever you fucking bring it forth and you want to shove it down people's fucking throats like some goddamn fucking door-to-door -door salesman who's trying to make sure that I fucking buy into your goddamn fucking crap. Fuck that, fuck you, fuck all this, and frankly, nerds, nerdettes, and gamers, game the fuck on, and fanboys, die.